Right, last summer has already becoming something of a distant memory, for me anyway. And I'm sure a lot of you are feeling the same. And that obviously means that Christmas now is literally just around the corner. It's what, five, five and a half, six weeks away? Now, I received a newsletter from YouTube about two weeks ago now, at the beginning of November, telling me that searches related to Christmas had already existentially increased to a very high level. And in true YouTube fashion, I thought, well, I really ought to do a top 10 list of Christmas gifts for the Baker or T120 owner. Now, I am actually a little bit late making this video because I've had a lot of other things going on, as you know, and also it's really difficult to choose items to go into this list. I've set up a criteria of each of these products must be something that I've reviewed and they also must be something that I use on a regular basis. By and large, I've selected each of these products based on the amount of views that the reviews achieved at the time that they were released. But I will say that there are one or two items in this list that did okay perhaps didn't achieve the best views possible but in my mind they are worthy of inclusion. Now I don't place any precedence between these items and I decided the best way to place them was in order of retail value starting with the most expensive first and the least expensive at the end. That way the order doesn't express any preference to their actual value. I would also like to point out to some of the more skeptical viewers that I do not receive any payment for carrying out these reviews and I do not receive any financial compensation for producing this video. So now we've got that out of the way, let's get on with it, starting at number 10. Now, Muckoff have been my go-to brand uh, for over a decade when it comes to motorcycle care and even the care of the gear that I use whether that be cleaning the inside of my helmet or scraping the bugs off my visor or goggles what I'm showing you here represents their ultimate valeting kit at just under a hundred pound and it contains pretty much anything that your bike out could possibly need for looking after his bike but it isn't the only kit that Muckoff do. They offer a range of kits or Christmas gift packs which will cater for just about any aspect of motorcycling at prices that will suit just about any pocket, right down to £9.99 for the visor cleaning kit. I personally haven't found a more suitable range of products for bike care on the market and I think any biker would be quite happy to find one of these kits underneath the Christmas tree on Christmas morning. Number 9. Halcyon Mark 49 Classic Motorcycle Goggles are a motorcycling icon. They are the very epitome of the classic motorcycle goggle, handmade from brass and hand stitched leather. They're a luxury goggle that will last the rider for years. And I've noticed recently that they seem to be the obligatory choice for film and TV. Now these are the classic black leather and chrome goggles. Apparently these are Halcyon's best seller. They exude that classic 50s or 60s look, combined with a classic open faced helmet. And they're one of the few motorcycling products you can buy today that can still trace the pedigree back to the early part of last century. From the nailed bridge adjuster to the British Standards compliant lenses in glass or polycarbonate, they're not just a piece of safety equipment, they're also every bit a fashion accessory. And if the rider in your life likes to wear an open face helmet, you could do a lot worse than get him or her a pair of these for Christmas. They come in several different colour variations and like everything else in this video I'll leave a link to the manufacturer's website so you can have a look through them yourself. Number 8. Now an Optimate battery optimizer is probably one of those things that people are a little reluctant to buy themselves. It doesn't make you look good and it doesn't make your bike go any faster. But on that cold January morning when you turn the key on your bike and nothing happens, you'll soon wish that you'd had one. In a way, that's why I think this makes the perfect Christmas gift. And it's something that every biker needs. 
It offers you a safe, foolproof way of maintaining your battery and making sure that you get optimum life out of it with a minimum of hassle. It's a quick and easy piece of equipment to install. And once you've done that, it's hassle free. And it doesn't matter how long you leave your bike unattended in the garage during the winter months, you can be sure that the Optimate is doing its job of looking after your battery for you. So the next time you jump on your bike, you know that your battery is in the best condition it could possibly be in. Number seven. Now I don't know about you, but I don't know anybody that doesn't own a mobile phone. And mobiles are so much more than just a phone these days. One particular facility that they have is that of a sat-nav. But in order to use it as a sat-nav, you need a strong, reliable, well-designed mount to mount it on your handlebars. And that's where the quadlock comes in. Now, quadlock does seem to be the name in mobile phone mounting systems these days, and there's a good reason for that. They're not the cheapest on the market, but I do believe that they are the strongest and the best thought out units on the market. Now the mount is universal and comes in a box on its own, but obviously the actual phone cases are phone specific. So you will need to make sure that you've got the right one. And if that motorcyclist in your life doesn't have a waterproof phone, you might also want to consider getting one of Quadlock's ponchos, which is basically a waterproof cover that goes over the phone to protect it from the elements. They come well packaged with plenty of fitting options and fitting itself is a very quick and straightforward operation. And the actual quadlock mounting system itself is probably the most secure I've ever seen. Again, this is the perfect stocking filler at Christmas. And I don't honestly believe that any mobile phone user that also rides a bike would be disappointed to open this on Christmas day. Number six. Now a wise man once said, that you can never have enough petrol caps, and I agree with him. Motone Customs make a great high quality range of twist-on petrol caps for both the Bonneville and for the Harley Davidsons. They all follow the same basic design, but they come made in two materials, brass and aluminium, and they also come in a variety of finishes. Unlike the original factory fitted petrol cap, they go on and off with ease which means you can swap and change them as the mood takes you. And if you want to go for that racy look, you can also plump for the flip up Monza style fuel cap, which in itself is a work of art. It's my ambition to have a fuel cap for every day of the week. And I'm certainly hoping that I'm going to get one in my Christmas stocking this year to add to my collection. Number five. Gloves, as you know, are the perfect Christmas gift. And when it comes to motorcycle gloves, classic motorcycle gloves, Gold Top England are the go-to company. They've been making motorcycle gear since the early 1950s. And the traditional classic designs combined with hand-sewn craftsmanship means you're unlikely to find a better and more stylish glove at twice the price. Now the short cafe racer glove is my personal favourite. Although if that doesn't float your boat, there are plenty of others to choose from. Classic black leather with vintage cream racing stripes is a winning combination that gives you the perfect look for your classic or custom ride. I don't honestly believe I've found gloves that are more comfortable than those that Gold Top make. And generally for under 50 pounds, that in my mind makes them a bargain. These gloves are perfect for the lady or gentleman rider, and with Gold Top's reputation for style and quality, you're certainly not going to spoil anybody's Christmas by giving them a pair of these. Number four. The side stand footprint enlarger from RNG is another one of those gifts that's immensely useful to the biker. And RNG are unusual in, in that as far as I'm aware, they're the only one that makes these accessories for the Bonneville range. They're made from the highest quality materials and the fit and finish is perfect. Installation's quick and easy. And this side stand foot enlarger is one of those things that one day might just save your bike. For camping or at bike meets where you're forced to park your bike on soft ground, these things really come into their own. Keeping your bike safe and upright while everybody else is running around looking for tin cans or bits of wood to put the side stands on so the bikes don't fall over. Number three. 
Tech Bike Parts is a well-known manufacturer of useful accessories for the Triumph Bonneville range, old and new. And these CNC machine from billet levers for both your brake and your clutch are a perfect addition to any Bonneville owner's bike. Despite the low price, they're a very high quality item with a superb finishing glossy anodized black. The six position adjustment on both levers mean you can adjust it to the perfect reach for any rider. Designed to integrate perfectly with the Bonneville's lever mounts, they're quick and easy to fit. They don't just look good, they feel good as well. And their ergonomic design means that they're a perfect replacement for those less than perfect Triumph items that come with the bike. Number two. Now, strictly speaking, this isn't a motorcycle accessory, but for anybody that goes motorcycle camping, it's a must have. And because of its popularity, I simply couldn't leave it out of this list. Up until a year ago, I'd never even heard of the fledgling company Trekology, but it's now become famous among motorcycle campers and backpackers alike for its high quality, super strong camping chairs and tables that fold away to a compact size, yet amazingly are sold for approximately half the price of the competition. Now, if your other half is a biker and he likes to go bike camping and he doesn't have one of these chairs, it is the perfect Christmas gift for him. This chair weighs less than a kilo and folded down, it can easily be incorporated into the most restricted motorcycle luggage. I've used this chair on many occasions and I cannot fault it. Trekology have also recently brought out a sand mat that fits underneath this chair to stop it sinking into sand or soft ground, which is a problem that occurs with all of these types of chairs irrespective of price or manufacturer. They're a quality item that's built to last that functions perfectly. And if I didn't have one, it would definitely be on my Christmas list. Number one. Now, lastly, but by no means least, is the Lomo leg bag. Now, a lot of people scoffed at this product when it was first released, myself included. But once I actually gave it a try to coin a phrase, it became one of those things I never knew that I needed. It's a small watertight dry bag that simply clips around your waist and fastens to your leg holster style. And it's useful for keeping any of those items like your phone, your keys, your wallet, anything else that's water sensitive, bone dry no matter what the weather's doing. It's safe and secure and quickly becomes indispensable. Now I think even Lomo misjudged this product and I found out a few weeks after doing the review that they'd actually sold their entire 2017 summer stock by the end of June. They have now actually restocked back in October but be aware this is a popular item and it may not be in stock for long. Right so that's it, that's my top pick Christmas list for 2017. Now the best advice I can give you if there's anything on this list that you like, set up your laptop, your tablet, your smart TV and your mobile phone and put this video on repeat and leave it running around the house so that your other half is not going to fail to take notice. That's all I've got time for this week, I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please leave a like and subscribe. I'll see you next Wednesday with the first instalment of the Bonneville series. And I'll catch you then.